How powerful was Alistair Moody? The Order member was considered the most powerful and successful Auror of his time. According to Charlie Weasley, Moody was responsible for filling half the cells in Azkaban. It's not surprising, however, as Moody came from a whole family line of skilled Aurors. Not only are his magical abilities extremely high level, they're diversified as well. He received excellent marks at concealment, disguise, stealth, and tracking during his Auror training. He successfully hunted down and defeated many Death Eaters, such as Evan Rosier and Igor Kargaroff, and even took a talented young Tonks under his wing for training. Mad Eye fought in the Battle of the Department of Mystery where he defeated a Death Eater with a single non-verbal spell. Moody never hesitated to go up against powerful Dark Wizards, including Lord Voldemort himself. His plan for getting Harry to safety involved using himself as a decoy, knowing full well that Voldemort would go after the most powerful defender. Mad Eye probably only got killed because he was trying to stop Monungus Fletcher from disapparating, which allowed Voldemort to catch Moody off guard with the Killing Curse. All in all, Mad Eye was tough, brave, and strong, and dedicated his life to fighting for the light. He deserves a power scale score of 9.7 out of 10. What do you think? Follow our podcast for more Harry Potter content.